Harry jumps down Oprah's throat after knowing her plot making use of him to make money. Meghan Markle's father Thomas Markle, in a recent interview, accused American host Oprah Winfrey of using Meghan and Prince Harry to build her new shows. He also called Prince Harry a weakened man. Seems like Meghan Markle's father Thomas Markle has now shifted his target of criticizing Meghan and Prince Harry to American host Oprah Winfrey. The Duchess of Sussex's father recently appeared on Australia's 60 Minutes show, and claimed that he and Prince Charles have one thing in common that they have both been ghosted by Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, but kept his harshest criticism reserved for Oprah Winfrey, reported TMZ. Targeting Oprah for her recent mental health docuseries The Me You Can't See, Thomas claimed that the American host took advantage of a weakened Prince Harry to build her own network. He said, I have things to say. Oprah Winfrey, for one, I think is playing Harry and Meghan. I think she is using them to build her network and build her new shows and I think she's taken advantage of a very weakened man and has got him to say things that you just shouldn't be saying on television. On a related note, Oprah already owns a cable channel named OWN that is jointly owned by Discovery Incorporated. She also owns the Harper Studios that launched on January 1, 2011, replacing the Discovery Health Channel. However, her interview with Meghan and Harry got massive attention as compared to her previous interviews. Accusing her further, Thomas added, she, Oprah, will disagree of course, and she may even sue me. I don't care. But, the bottom line is she is working with Harry. Thomas also revealed that he learned of the birth of her new granddaughter Lilibet from Harry and Meghan's public statement, and he found that disappointing. Coming back to Oprah Winfrey's talk show, the 67-year-old host has worked with Prince Harry quite a bit lately, first by interviewing him and Meghan for their bombshell, tell-all interview which included claims of racism and allegedly turning a blind eye to mental health needs against the royal family. As U.S. talk show icon Oprah Winfrey sits down to interview both Meghan Markle, Duchess of Sussex and her husband Prince Harry, Duke of Sussex in their first major television discussion of their decision to step down as senior members of the royal family, many will be wondering just exactly what history Oprah has with the pair of them. Well, many followers of the Sussexes will be aware that Oprah attended the couple's royal wedding back in 2018. The happy couple had invited the titan of U.S. television and film to their big day at St. George's Chapel, Windsor Castle. Speaking to ET Online in June 2018, Oprah had reflected on how monumental the union was. She said, It was more than a wedding, I thought. It was a cultural moment. And you could not be there or watching on television. And not feel that there was a shift that just happened in the middle of it. Oprah added that the wedding was bigger than what it just meant for the couple and would have a positive impact on all of us. The paper reports that they had only met on that one occasion as part of overtures from the network, but after this, Oprah was keen to offer friendship and guidance to the Duchess as she grew into her role. The Mirror has reached out to a representative of Oprah Winfrey for comment on this report. In the run-up to the wedding itself, Oprah also spent time with Meghan's mother, Doria Ragland. She revealed that she and Doria spent an afternoon snacking on kumquat desserts and doing yoga together.